everybody, welcome to The Colors of Beauty by Elle. I'm Isabel. Welcome back and welcome all my new subscribers. I hope you guys are having a beautiful, colorful day or night, where you know, whichever you guys are watching me at the moment. Um, so today I have a review and a swatch video for you guys um, on the new Hourglass Moder Modernist palette. Now, I believe that this comes in four, I think it's four or five different uh, palette colors. I'm not really sure. I'm guessing, I'm guessing it comes in four. Um, but this is what the packaging looks like. I did order it um, from, where did I order it from? From uh, Sephora, I believe, before that it all came out. Um, and I paid $58 for this palette. It is on the pricey side because it is a little bit um, on the upscale spectrum of the makeup industry. So um, let me tell you a little bit about it. Um, now, this is what the packaging on the inside looks like. This is the palette itself. It's very it's smaller it is really nice for travel i have to say and i do like that it's a harder case because you don't have to worry about it getting squished or breaking of you know it breaking when if you've got it in your purse or the suitcase or whatever so on the inside it is just absolutely gorgeous they have such beautiful packaging on this palette here Look at this, you guys. It just looks like a ripple of just a ripple of waves of uh, bronzy colorness. Now, I got the color Obscura, and this is more of the earth tone colors, the one that I got out. And look at this. It's absolutely beautiful, gorgeous. Now, I did pay $58, like I said, and the product in here, you get... Um, Let's see, you get a net weight of 0 0.03 ounces times five, meaning that all of these are about that, that many ounces in these five different colors. Now, I really, really love the way that they did this. You know, they put them all in here. Um, it's just, it's just so beautiful. And I think that a lot of people like it because of that effect, you know, that it has when you open the the box here it's just so pretty okay now these don't have um these don't have names on them so i'm just gonna go ahead and swatch swatch it and then tell you my thoughts on each of these colors here now i have used it before and i do have i did this look with with this palette today and I will do a tutorial on this on my next video. So the next video that you see after this one um, that will come up is going to be a tutorial on this look that I have on today. So, okay, so let's go on with the swatches. This one here is a matte cream color. Now, it's so soft. It is a really, really, really soft. I mean, it is so soft. Look how soft that is. It's so soft that it comes off, you know, there's a lot on your finger. So, um, and it is powdery. Now, I find this one to be a little bit powdery, you know, just a little bit, but it does, it blends really, really well. Um, so that's this one here. Okay, this one's also a matte color. This is described as a smoky brown. Look at this. It's so soft, too. So you want to be really careful when you're, you know, putting your brush in there. Um, if you have, if you get these palettes. Now, and, and but it, this, they describe this one as a uh, matte, but it, it kind of goes on more like a satiny color, I think, because of the texture of it. And, and it's just so, so pigmented and so creamy. And this one, just blends like a dream. I love it. Okay, they, they describe this one as a rosy bronze. It's also really, really, really soft. 
See that? Isn't that pretty? And it, but it just, it goes on like a dream. Look at that sheen. It is so pretty. Oh my goodness. It's just so gorgeous. So gorgeous. It, and it just blends like butter very, very well. Um, okay. But it also, but also it is a little bit, I do have to say that it is a little bit powdery as well. Now this one here, they describe this one as a, it's a taupe deep brown. This is what that one looks like. Okay. And I mean, this one is also, look at this, you guys. It's so pretty. It's matte and it goes on so beautifully. I just think that the, this is so pretty. It is such a, the, the, I, I have no words. The colors are so creamy, um, but they are powdery. Oh, so you not, need to be careful. Now this one here, the, the very last one here up in this corner, this one swatches more powdery than the rest of them. So here it is here. So this, this you've got to be really, really careful when you put your brush in there because look at that, you guys. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. So pretty. Oh, 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 love it. But, but that one is a little bit, um, what am I trying to say? This one is more powdery <laughs> than the rest of them, in my opinion. Um, now, when you put your brush in here, you really, really want to be careful with how you put your brush in here. You want to really dab it like this instead of, you know, going like this or sweeping it. So just kind of place your brush on top of the eyeshadows because they are so creamy and so buttery, but yet they are a little powdery, especially this one here. So um, such a pretty, pretty palette. I really have been enjoying it very, very much. I'm thinking about getting another one they have another one that's got more like a mauve colors in it. I'm thinking about getting that one too. I'm not sure. Um, but this one caught my eye only because I really love the um, the earth tones in this one. And you could wear this one for an everyday look. Or you can also do a smoky eye. Um, just different, different looks with this too. I love it. I hope you guys... Um, enjoyed this review to this review swatch video <laughs> I can't talk today you guys I think it's because I have a sore throat and it's because I have a sore throat um so anyways I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up so I hope this was helpful for you guys to see if you if you want it um you know if you think you're it's worth getting this particular one. I'm sure there's other people out there who have done um, swatches and reviews on different colors so that you guys can go check those out too. Um, if I get the other one, I'll certainly do a swatch video on it as well. Um, I don't know if the other ones do swatch powdery like this one does. Um, I don't know, because I didn't, uh, I haven't seen them you know, in the stores. Um, haven't gone to the store to swatch them, but this one is uh, a bit powdery. So just forewarn, if you get this particular one, be careful with your brush. Okay. All right, you guys, thanks for stopping in. Don't forget, I do have snail mail um, and I do have a Facebook and Instagram. And don't forget, leave me your thoughts, your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about it. Um, you know, it's just good to know what you guys think because I, I like to get your feedback on it. And um, let me know if you guys have other colors. If you got them in a different color, in a different color palette, that is. And uh, tell me how you like it. Is it is it as um, powdery as the one I have? Is it not as powdery? You know, that way maybe I might say, oh, I might want to get that particular one instead, you know. So, okay, I will see you guys in the next video and enjoy all the colors of beauty around you guys. Okay, bye. <laughs> Subscribe.